I think we can all agree that things are a little bit different right now. I mean, I don't know about you, but I'm working from my basement. I've set up a home office here. I'm doing my sessions with a green screen in the background and using the internet to do all of my sessions remotely, which I normally do in person. And one of the things that I keep hearing over and over again from my clients is the need for agility. And I found that really so interesting that I pulled the agility card out of my deck of shift cards because I wanted to read it to you and share what's written on the back of the card to you. So I'm just gonna read from the back of the card. And what it says is, Agility is an organization's ability to respond quickly and effectively to any type of change that it may be faced with. As new market research opens new opportunities, organizations must have the capacity to make regular adjustments to their business plan. And this is the bit that captured everyone's imagination. Agility could one day be valuable if a need arises to pivot and adapt to a fundamentally new business model in response to a significant disruption or unexpected discovery. And I think we can all agree that we're in the middle of a significant disruption right now. So a lot of my clients have been highlighting agility as one of the values that they and their leaders and their organizations need to be doubling down on in this time of crisis. And one of the stories that I found so inspiring over the past two weeks is the story of the microbreweries in Calgary. And if you haven't heard the story, it's really inspiring. It turns out that Everybody's been hoarding hand sanitizer, as you know, and it turns out that the main ingredients in hand sanitizers are the same ingredients that are used in the microbrewery process, namely ethanol and I think it's high glycerol. And so a lot of the microbreweries realized that they could step into this space, which was really important because their tasting rooms were closed, a lot of the bars were closed where they get a lot of their business, and a lot of the microbreweries don't do a lot of business through the liquor stores. So they needed this new source of revenue. And they realized that they could be making hand sanitizer and distributing it around the city to fill that gap. And what I found really inspiring was that a lot of these microbreweries did it together. So one company would do one part of the process and they hand it off to another company so that they could really increase capacity. And I found that a really inspiring story, not just about pivoting a business in a time of need, but not just meeting a community need, but also about doing it together. So with that in mind, here's to agility and here's to the microbreweries. Mm. I think that's the hand sanitizer. <laughs>